In this tutorial, we will learn how to create this 3D pop-out in Adobe Photoshop. Choose the Rectangle tool. Let's draw a rectangle. Adjust its corner like this. Choose any color. And no stroke. Now choose the Move tool. Press Ctrl T. Right click and choose Distort. When you finish press enter. Drag your photo to Photoshop, you can find this photo link in the description below. Choose the pen tool. If you want to learn how to use the pen tool, you can check the tutorial link in the description below. You have multiple ways to remove the background other than the pen tool but I decided to use the pen tool in this tutorial. Right click and choose make selection. Add a layer mask. Choose the move tool and drag your image accordingly. Now hide your image. Choose the pen tool. Right click and choose make selection. Go to adjustment layer and choose solid color. Now select both of these layers while holding the shift button. Right click and choose convert to smart object. Put this layer under the image layer. Now unhide your image layer. Right click on this shape and choose select pixels. Create new folder. Add a layer mask. Drag it inside the folder. Right click on the folder layer and choose a color for that folder. Choose the image layer. Press Ctrl J to duplicate the image layer. Drag it on top of the layers. Click on the mask. Choose the brush tool. Choose the brush size, and set the hardness to 100%. Set the opacity and the flow to 100%. Make sure the foreground color is black and start painting. Now choose the Move tool. Go to Adjustment layer and choose Gradient Map. Follow these settings. Right click and choose create clipping mask. This will only affect the layer below. Duplicate this adjustment layer. Let's put it over the other image. Right click and choose create clipping mask. Click on these layers while holding the shift button and link them together. Go to layer style and choose stroke. Follow these settings. When you finish press OK. Reduce the fill to 0%. Go to Adjustment Layer and choose Solid Color. Let's adjust the stroke here. Change the position to Outside. When you finish press OK. 
Go to Adjustment Layer and choose Gradient Overlay. Follow these settings. When you finish press OK. Now go to adjustment layer and choose brightness contrast. Follow these settings. Click on this icon to only affect the layer below it. Let's do the same thing for the upper image. Hold shift and select all these layers. Right click and choose convert to smart object. Press ctrl T and scale it. Now choose the type tool and write your text. Let's change the font and its style. Now choose the Move tool. Press Ctrl T and scale it while holding the Shift button. Choose the type tool and write another text. Let's change its color to white. Let's change the font and its style. Press Ctrl T and scale it while holding the Shift button. Go to File, Export and choose Save for Web. Follow these settings. That's it, hope you liked it. Subscribe for more tutorials.